I'm going to have to say yes and no to this question. The question is the things that Jesus taught, do they work or not? Or we apply to his teachings, drugs, ganging would go away. Some of the teachings will work, some of them will not. The main things that will not will be the things that were left out. A lot of the things that were left out you can find in books like the Gospel of Thomas. But you can also find teachings similar in Buddhism, Hinduism, Taoism as well, and many other forms of religions. Now, I have a book, and I'm going to have to speak from this book uh, one day. Uh, somebody borrowed it and haven't given it back yet. But it is similar teachings of Jesus, Buddha, Krishna, and Lao Tzu. And it shows how each one taught a very, very similar message. Now, I do think that Jesus taught a better message than the Old Testament God, that he was more moral than the Old Testament God, turn the other cheek, let he without sin cast the first stone. But as far as the, with ganging, ganging and, and drugs and all that go away, remember Jesus did teach you that the poor will always be amongst you. And it's not the poor financially, not only I should say the poor financially, but it would be the poor of mind will always be among you. So the poor of mind don't see a way out of poverty other than through theft or killing or things of that nature. The poor of mind sees the world as a place of power and control and want to control the masses and don't care if people survive. You see, the poor of mind will say that instead of curing cancer, that I'd rather make you a drug that I can, you can live with cancer and I can keep making money. See, that's the poor of mind. And it goes in so many different fashions because the poor of mind will still beat their spouse, will still rape, will still pillage. So there are some things that were left out. How about no slavery? Jesus never taught that, never went against that. How about equating men and women as equal? Now he taught that in the Gospel of Thomas and in the Gospel of, Sof not Sophia, the Gospel of Mary Magdalene. So they, they were taught there, but that's not in your canon. You see, the Buddha taught those same things. But he didn't say anything about ending slavery. It's amazing how these teachers taught a higher morality than their culture that they were in, but still was stuck in the culture that they were in because of so many things they did not say. And unfortunately, no matter how many religions we have, no matter how many philosophers we have, people, there will always be some people who will go and vibrate to the lowest form. There is no one teaching that everyone will follow. There is no one way that everybody can follow. Therefore, we have to try to encircle those that we know with the best we have. 